What's up guys, Trainer Mystic back here with another video, and in today's video I'm going to be going over some new news, well it's not really new news, but um, it's stuff that you need to know about that's going to be happening in the Luminous Legends Y event, so let's begin. So first, we got the Luminous Legends Y event, uh, event exclusive field research tasks starting today at May 18th at 10 o'clock a.m. local time until May 25th. 2021 at 8 o'clock p.m. local time. So, first we're going to have catch five shadow Pokemon, and that's going to give you a Skorupi, which can be shiny. And then we got purify five shadow Pokemon for a Spritzy or a Swirlix. And then we got defeat a Team Go Rocket Leader for Galarian Zigzagoon. And then we got defeat two Team Go Rocket Grunts for a Murkrow and Houndour, which can be both shiny and then Purloin. Defeat five Team Go Rocket Grunts for Me Alolan Meowth, which can be shiny. And then we got win two raids for Scraggy. And then max CP for Skorupi is, can be, is going to be 432. For Galarian Zigzagoon, is going to be um, 218. For um, Alolan Meowth, this is going to be 341 CP. For... Spritzy, it's going to be 536 CP. For Swirlix, it's going to be 505 CP. For um, Scraggy, it's going to be 588 CP. For Purloin, it's going to be 330 CP. And for Houndwar, it's going to be 529 CP. And then, last but not least, we we got Murkrow at 6, 669 CP. So that's going to be the... Um, event exclusive field research tasks, the five shadow Pokemon of Purify and all that stuff. So yeah, on to the next one. Okay, so um, this will be um all the quests. The or not the this is gonna be the limit the time research. Also, uh, from May eighteenth at ten o'clock a.m. local time until May thirty first at eight o'clock p.m. local time. So we're gonna have. Step one out of seven, and it's going to be defeat five Team Go Rocket Grants for 15 Pokeballs, and then five, catch five Shadow Pokemon for our Meowth, which can be shiny, and the max CP is going to be 320. And we got five catch Dark type Pokemon for our Lowland Ranata, which can be shiny for and the max CP is 315 CP. And then the rewards we're going to get, you're going to get 1000 XP and a Stunky, and the max CP is 493. And then we got um, step two is purify three shadow Pokemon for five, uh, purple potions. F uh, purify five shadow Pokemon for three revives and purify seven shadow Pokemon for one, um, mysterious component. And then the XP the rewards are going to be 2000 XP and a low and Ratata, which can be shiny for a uh, max CP at 315. And then, um... Step three out of seven, we got um, defeat all three of the leaders for uh, 2,000 XP each. So two times two is four. Four times two is 8,000. So eight, we're going to get 8,000 XP from that. And then um, we're going to get a 2,000 XP um, in a Murkrow, which will, can be shiny. Um, and the max CP is going to be 669. And then after I'm done reading this, I'm gonna I'm, I might add up all the XP together and then multiply actually no multiply it all together and see how much you'll get in total. And then we got Purify Eight Shadow Pokemon for a uh I think it's called a Grassy Learn Module. And then we got Evolve Eight Pokemon for an Eevee, which will be the max CP for four fifty nine, and it can be shiny. And then Earn Eight Hearts with your buddy for one Glacial Learn Module. And then we get the reward for 3,000 XP and a Mighty Yena um, encounter. For, and the max CP for that's going to be 825. And then um, step seven, we're going to, or five, that, not six. Uh, we're gonna, for step five out of seven, it's going to be defeat eight Team Go Rock Grunts for seven Pineapple Berries. Use an incense for a Galarian Zigzagoon encounter, which we don't, we. We don't know yet. We it might. We know the shiny is coming out, but um, yeah. I don't. Um, so it says down here unlocked by reaching goal. So we have to reach the goal first in order to unlock it, and then the max CP for it's gonna oh use an instance for Galarian Zigzagoon, 
Um, max CP is going to be 218. We can get the shiny if we all complete the challenge, which is like the grunt thing. And then catch 20 dark type Pokemon for Sneasel. And the max CP is going to be 879. And it can be shiny. And then the rewards, we're going to get 3,000 XP and Alolan Meowth, which can be shiny with the CP max of 341. I believe. Yeah, no, CP 341. Not max. And then step 6 out of 7 is going to be catch. Or not catch. Complete 7 field research tasks for 10 star. Ten, uh, I can't speak, guys. 10 Great Balls, win one raid for a Houndoom. And the max CP for that is going to be 1,129. 1, and then catch five different species of dark type Pokemon for a low and grammar. And the max CP is going to be 589. And the rewards are going to be 4,000 XP in Absol, which can be shiny for a 1,083. And the max CP, no, sorry, Mac, not max. The CP for that is going to be 1,083. Last but not least, we got Purified 10 Shadow Pokemon for. One Pokeball, okay, okay, Niantic, thank you for that, we, that's, okay. Defeat a team, a go, yeah, team go rocket leader three times, so you can do Sierra, Cliff, or Arlo three times. Um, for Galarian Zigzagoon encounter, and the max CP is going to be 218, and then catch 12 Shadow Pokemon for a Larvitar, which with a max CP of 445 and it can be shiny and then the, we're gonna get a um, reward of 5,000 XP and a dino or dino encounter and the max CP is gonna be 455 so now if we go back if we uh, multiply all of it so 1,000 XP times 2,000 XP is 2,000 XP times another 2,000 XP is um 8,000, and then 16,000, 32,000, 64,000. 64 times 3 is, um, I, I'm not going to do the math. But you guys get the picture. Um, if I had a calculator, I would, but I don't have one next to me. Um, but if you guys, um, want to just multiply all those XP numbers by yourself, feel free to do it and let me know how much XP you'll get from this research um so yeah that's gonna be um the limited research anyway to the next one um we got the current raid bosses um from may 18th at 10 o'clock a.m until a.m till may 25th 2021 at 8 o'clock p.m lo your local time and then we're gonna have the tier one raids with the lowlin meowth which can be shiny with a wait yeah, it can be shiny, I believe. Wait, yeah, 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 it can be shiny. Um, and then the CP is going to be 459, and Weather Boost is going to be uh, 569. Then we're going to have Esper, which is Psychic type, and it's going to be 719. And the Weather Boost is going to be 899. And then we're going to have Murkrow, which is a Dark and Flying type. Um, which can be shiny with a CP of 892. The weather boost is going to be 1,116. Um, and then we got Sneasel, which can be shiny, which is a dark and ice type. And the CPs for that's going to be 1,172 CP. And then the, um, the, um, weather boost is going to be 1,465. So that's going to be tier one raid boss bosses and then tier three you're gonna have galarian wheezing which i've not seen that in raids in a bit with um poison and fairy and the cp for that's gonna be 1310 and then weather beast is gonna be 1637 we got cacturn um which is a grass and dark type with a cp of 1313 and a weather boost of CP of 1,641. Then we got Absol, which can be shiny. And that's going to be a dark type. And the CP for that is going to be 1,443. And then the um, weather boost is going to be 1,805. And then we got Tyranitar, which is going to be a rock and dark type. And that's going to be for the CP of 2,191. And the uh, weather boost is going to be 2,739. And then that's going to be the tier 3 bosses. And then we got um, the Mega um, Pokemon. We got Mega Alteria, which was the new Calm Day 
based uh, mega Pokemon. It's gonna be a Dragon and Fury type. Lots of um, puffy feathers. Max CP is gonna be eleven forty five, and then the weather boost is gonna be um, what one thousand four hundred thirty two. We got Mega Houndoom, which is gonna be a Dark and Fire type with a CP of one thousand five hundred five and a weather boost of one eighteen eighty two. And then, last but not least, we got Mega Ampharos, which is going to be Electric and Dragon type. With a, um, and it can also be Shiny. Oh, so all the Mega Bosses can be Shiny. And then, yep, Mega Ampharos can be Shiny, Dragon type, and Electric type. CP 1630, or for the Max, I believe. And then, um, the, um, the uh, Weather Boost is going to be 2037. Not, last but not least, we got the brand new legendary Evotol. And that's going to be a dark and flying type. And the um, max CP is going to be 2160, which is the hundo. And then twenty, the weather boost is going to be 2701. So I believe all these top numbers are going to be the hundos. So that's what you want to look out for because I saw that that's what everyone was saying in some live some live streams that 2160 is going to be the um, CP the, for the Hundo for Evo So yeah, that's going to be the current raid bosses. Um, Galarian, or not Galarian, Alola, Meowth, Esper, Murkrow, Sneasel, Galarian, Weezing, Cactor, and Absol, Ter Ter Tyranitar, <coughs> Mega, Alteria, Houndoom, and Anfros, and Evo So yeah, on to the last but not least, we got the brand new team... Go Rocket Leader um, rotation. Available for May... Or lineup, sorry. Available for May 18th, 2021 at 10 o'clock a.m. until our local time. So we're going to have Cliff. And his first is can, can be Seedot. And it can be Shiny. And um, the... Um, I don't know what that means. It's resistant to... Um, fire, Flying, Poison, gr Bug, and Ice. Second is, uh, these can be the random ones. We're going to have Kingler, which is a water type, and it's uh, weak to um, grass and electric. We got um, Hariyama, which is a fighting type, and it's weak. I think that's weak. Yeah, it's weak to fairy, flying, and psychic. And then we got Polyrath, which is a um, fighting and water type, and that's going to be... Um, weak to fairy, flying, psychic, electric, and grass. And then we got, a uh, Sharpedo. And that's gonna be a fl or not flying, I was about to say flying. A water and dark type. And that's gonna be weak to fairy, grass, electric, wait, I said, or no, sorry. Fairy, bug, electric, grass, and fighting. And then we got Torterra, um, which is gonna be a grass and ground type. And that's going to be weak to Ice, Fire, Flying, and Bug. And then we're going to have Tyranitar, which is a Ground and Dark type. And that's going to be weak to Fighting, Fairy, fl uh, Ground, Bug, Steel, f Water, and um, f Bug, uh, Grass type, sorry. So next we're going to have uh, Sierra. So s the first one for him is going to be s her. Sorry, sorry, Sierra misgendered lol don't hate me don't hate on me youtube for doing that sorry sorry to all the females out there love y'all you guys are awesome anyway uh sneasel it's gonna be a dark and ice type and it can be shiny and um it's weak to um fighting fairy bug steel fire and ground types and we got Gl gliscor or Gliscor, I think it's Gliscor. And that is going to be a ground and flying type, and it's weak to ice and water. And then we got Granbull, which is a fairy type, and that's going to be weak to um, steel and poison. I think, th I believe that's what weak stands for, right? I think. Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, Ampharos, which is a full electric type, and it's going to be weak to ground. And then um, we're going to have... The two random, three random ones, 
It can be Kingjo, which is a dragon water type, and it's weak to fairy and dragon, which I don't understand why it would be resist weak to its own type. And then we got Houndoom, which is a dark fire type, and it's weak to fighting ground, fighting ground, um, water and rock. Oh, that's rock type. Got it. Okay. And then we got Drapion, which is a poison and dark type, and that's gonna be um weak to rock. Last but not least, we got Sir Arlo. Arlo's going to have Venonat, which is a bug and poison type. And it's going to be weak to uh, Fire, po uh, Water, Rock, and Psychic. We're going to have Manetric, which is an electric type. And it's going to be weak to Ground. And then Crobat is, is Flying and Poison. And that's going to be weak to um, Ice, Rock, Psychic, and Electric. We got Earth Ring, which is a normal type, and that's going to be weak to fighting types. And then we're going to have Magnezone, which is Electric Steel, and it's um, going to be weak to ground, fire, and fighting. Then we got Vile Plume, which is Grass and Poison type, and it's going to be weak to fire, flying, ice, and psychic. Last but not least, we got Mr. Scissor or Scizor, or whatever you want to call it. It's going to be a bug and steel type, and it's going to be weak to fire types. So, to cap it off, I'm going to cap... So, in that case, I'm going to cap it off here um, now. So, I want you all to let me know in the comment section after I post this video. Probably sometime tomorrow is when you're going to be watching this video. Let me know in the comment section... What you're gonna be, what you're, um, except what you're excited for, um, even though it's already, um, happening. Are you excited for the new Team Go Rocket Leader, um, rotation or line? I keep saying rotation lineup. Are you excited for the current raid bosses for the Y of current for the Luminous Y event? Are you excited for the limited research for the Y event? Are you excited for um, the event field research task. I'm honestly excited for all four of these because I need as much XP as possible. So, I, I'm going to end this video now. And I will see every single one of you amazing trainers in the next vid. Remember, train hard, training harder will bring you to success. And...